Okay guys, so at the time of this recording, the first episode of this series hasn't even been released yet. So I haven't seen any sort of feedback or um, or comments or anything like that. Uh, I kind of wanted to be able to do the first couple episodes, you know, on my own, totally blind. I've asked people to not spoil anything or give me any tips yet because I kind of want to try to do this game a little bit differently than I did the last one. I got a lot of help in the last game. I looked up a lot of stuff on my own and I would, would like to try my best to do things a little bit differently and, and um, figure things out on my own. So uh, whatever level of support that first episode got, thank you very much for ever, however many likes and views and whatever else. Uh, I appreciate it. Any new subscribers, thank you. Um, I just haven't seen it yet. So yeah, so the last thing we did in, in the, uh, the that first episode was we found sea truck fragments and um, off screen, I found all the things I needed to make a sea truck and a mobile vehicle bay besides one diamond for the enamel glass over there. All right, hey guys, real quick. I just spent so much time looking for diamonds to get enameled glass. And then I realized after I got the diamond that I didn't actually need it at all. I thought I needed it to get the sea truck. Didn't need it. I don't know what I was thinking uh, so i i needed the enameled glass to craft the uh sea truck depth module mark one and in between recordings i had just forgotten that that is why i had it pinned in the first place i i know i don't need it for the sea the sea truck i just in the moment while i was recording totally forgot that i had it pinned and and i thought i needed it to make the sea truck and just i don't know i, I i'm recording this right after waking up i don't think i fully I woke up when I was when I was recording this. So you're gonna hear me talking about getting diamonds in this to get enamel glass to make the sea truck. Don't even don't <laughs> Don't mind me, okay? I make the sea truck later in the episode. I do the exploring I want to do. I just do it way later than I had planned it in the episode because for some reason I, I thought I needed diamonds and I don't. So anyways, back to the video. Thank you. And I've looked all over this biome. I have a feeling whatever I need is not going to be in this biome. And while I was searching for it, um, I picked up this Delta Station dock beacon. I got a little message basically telling me to go here. I have a feeling that I'm going to have to explore a little bit further out to find the diamonds as opposed to going down. Once I go out and find the diamonds, I can come back to this area and go a little bit further because there's some areas kind of in this starting biome that I can't get to because they're just so far down and I have no air. So that's what we're going to start with is we're going to go to the Delta Station dock. Hopefully we can find a diamond there, come back, build a mobile vehicle bay and build a sea truck and do some more exploring. And if you haven't done so already, make sure to leave a like and subscribe to this video. And if you really want to help support the channel, become a channel member as well. It'd be greatly appreciated. Thank you very much. Delta Station Dock. There's the alien distress call origin. Where's there's there's gonna be that radio tower, right? Communications tower. I wish it was daytime. I'd love to be able to see a little bit better. Oh, hello. Oh, I think that's the island. I can see it. God, it's raining really hard. Wow. I can't really see anything in this area. I'm just gonna keep going until I can find a place to... Ooh, what is that thing? You look interesting. The crab boy. Here we go. Alright, cool. That wasn't that bad. Getting here. Okay, we got a PDA. Cargo rocket sea truck dock zero sector. Fred, I'm not blaming you. But what do you mean it's gone? Where did it go? You found some trouble somewhere in the deep twisty bridges and decided to jettison modules? Yeah, I had to jettison a module. I got free, went back for it, and it was just gone. And you think someone stole it? Or something. I didn't lose it, that's for sure. I'm careful with my tools. I'm sure you are, but you have to admit, there have been a lot of sea truck accidents, and they're rather expensive. You want to follow me on a few runs tomorrow? See what it's like? Conditions are way harsher than anything I ever imagined. I don't know if you could really understand it from inside your base. That won't be necessary. Thanks for your time. I'll write it up as an accident. Okay. Manuel is a little baby. Okay. I'm scanning all this stuff. Where's my habitat builder? Come on. Help me out. I want it. This is a recorded message. Hello? If you can hear this, you're trespassing. If you know it's good for you, you'll get the hell out of here. Okay. I, I, apparently, I don't know what's good for me because I'm going to keep going, so... Hello. I feel like sitting in sulfur basically to warm up is not the best idea. I feel like that's still pretty unsafe. Ooh. What is this? Ion cube already. Okay. Yeah. That's cool. 
Alien artifact. Material analysis station. New technology acquired. Resembling a human electron microscope or mass spectrometer, this tool appears to be designed for the purpose of analyzing physical raw materials. It is speculated that the scanning apparatus might be designed to collect small-scale DNA recipes for the replication of non-living objects. Okay, I got a new blueprint for what? Quantum locker. Storage solution which shares content with all other quantum lockers. Oh, that sounds pretty cool. Wow, okay. Well, I don't, ooh. Horseshoe shrub. Shrub nut. What is this? Like a thermal vent? I'm not seeing like anything on this island. Oh, I'm kind of backtracking. I'd love to find some diamonds. I don't, I really have no idea if they are on this island, but I'd really love to find some. Maybe they're like around the island. I don't know. Here's the communications tower. Oh, hello? Oh. Hello? Stop right there, Altera. You're out of bounds. I am not Altera. I'm not with Altera. Then your position is doubly precarious. Who are you? What do you mean? If you're telling the truth, you're out of your mind. Is that a prawn if suit? You're lying, there'll be hell to pay. Wait! Who are you? Stay off my land. Um I will not stay off your land. I need to explore more. The woman in the exosuit has been traced as far as my technology will allow. Oh, okay. It appear I'm far less alone on this planet than I had anticipated. Yeah. Signal location uploaded to PDA. Oh, pilot last known position. Okay, so she's all the way over there. Okay, so I guess that's my next thing. Go find that lady. Maybe she'll give me a prawn suit blueprint. Be kind of nice. Jukebox fragments. Ooh. 666. Ooh, lockers. Okay, cool. Fabricator. New blueprint synthesized. Thank you. Jukebox speaker. Altera facilities map. Okay. A map will come in handy. I should be able to find my way to Phi Robotics where Sam worked. Okay. What is Phi? This is Delta, I think. That's Omega. I don't know these other ones. I'm just going to scan all this stuff. I don't I don't need to include this in the video. Just know I scanned it all. Where is my habitat builder? I'm going to make a whole episode out of that. All right. We have a data box for a scanner room. That's cool. Integrating new PDA data. Still need a habitat builder, though. Still looking for one of those. Cushy setup. Must belong to one of those higher uppers. Possibly. Very possible. David. You'll be happy to know the Frost Pack is making excellent progress. I must say, my management style appears to be uniquely well suited to isolated planets. I miss you, of course, but I wonder if you feel it too. This guy. As great as we are together, we're almost better apart. This guy feels well very Frost full of himself. In her last show. I'm sorry I couldn't be there to see it, but I'm sure if I'd been around, I'd only have made her nervous. Once this mission is over. I'll come home for a few good months. And then, what do you think if we look at reorganizing our expectations to facilitate longer term separation success? This guy. I really think this could be a great model for us going forward, romantically and otherwise. Don't forget, I love you from the depths of my heart. Keep on succeeding in your projects. This guy's you know an idiot. I find more attractive. Wow, okay. Surveillance status report. Oh. Operating manual. New employee training. It is recommended that all tr uh, training be completed while tower is in test mode. Test mode is a fully functional simulated version of live mode. While in test mode, all communication from the tower, including distress signals, security alerts, and spy transmissions will be disabled. To initiate test mode, insert the test override module into the di diagnostic port as depicted in the, the diagram to the left. The activate test mode command may be entered via the terminal once the test override module has been inserted. I don't, I guess I don't have whatever I need for this yet because I, I, this isn't letting me do anything. Okay, I have no idea. Nobody tell me either, please no hints. I might just be missing something. 
I'm gonna take one look around these buildings while um, it's light out so I can see a little bit better. And then maybe, I'm thinking what maybe I'll do is uh, I'll check out the surrounding area around this island to see if there's anything uh, that I'm missing. Because there's, there's gotta be diamonds somewhere, like some sort of reasonable location. They have to be around here somewhere. Maybe not on this island, maybe surrounding the island, I don't know. Hello? Ooh, ooh. Right there. What is my... Can I crouch? Okay, I can't crouch. So now what do you want me to do? Okay. So. Let's do some exploring. Warning. 30 seconds of oxygen Hello? Remaining. What is that thing? That was loud. I don't know if that's going to be as loud in the video as it was in my ears, but wow, that was loud. What are you? I keep seeing quartz and thinking it's diamonds. It's not. What? Can I help you? Warning. 30 seconds of oxygen remaining. I'm working on it. Shut up. Stop it. Warning. 30 seconds of oxygen remaining. It was zero oxygen, dude. This place is kind of nasty. Mineral rich crevices detected below. Geothermal activity detected. Caution advised. Yeah. Oh. Shut up. Or, uh... Passing 100 meters. Oxygen efficiency decreased. Yeah. Ooh, wonder what all that is. Warning. 30 seconds of oxygen remaining. I know, I know, I know, I know, I know. All these... I don't know what these things are. They're loud. Loud as hell. Oh. Moon pool. Signal location uploaded to PDA. There was a diamond. There it is. There it is. There's one. Okay, hold on. Um, here, drink that. Oxygen. Take the diamonds. Get this. Swim Warning. for your life. Thirty seconds of oxygen remaining. Yep, I think we will we'll be able to just make it. Swim directly up. Oxygen. I'm working on it, lady. I'm working on it. I'm working on it. I got this. I got this. Don't worry. I got this. Look at that. See? Just in time. Okay. Awesome. So we... What the hell did I need enamel glass for? Wait, I swear. I swear I needed enamel glass or something. Hold on. What the f***? Am I insane? I must be absolutely insane because I swear to you I needed enameled glass for something and I just now realized it. Okay, wow, what a waste of time. Oh my god, I'm so stupid. It's because it was just pinned there. That I, I was like, yeah, I need this. I don't need it. Okay, well, um, that was a huge waste of time. I'm almost recording for an hour. I'm going to record for a little bit more because I've, I've wasted so much time looking for diamonds for no reason. We're going to get back to the life pod. We're going to build some of this stuff. We'll, we'll get our sea truck, and then we can explore the areas I wanted to explore. Oh my god, I'm so f dumb. Ugh, sorry, the hostility came out there for a little bit. I'm good. I'm good. Wow, that was my own fault. I don't know why I thought I needed enameled glass. What did I need that for? Nothing. What was I doing? A few moments later. Okay, so we need to make the habitat builder, right? Not the habitat builder, the, the mobile vehicle bay. Right. Okay. 
Okay, and then from there we get on it and we can make our sea truck. Yeah. Cannot build here. Must be constructed in deeper water. Okay, fine. Fine. How about right here? There we go. Thank you. Construct a sea truck. Nice. All right, cool. Got the sea truck. How do I get in? Through the top? Nice. Okay, cool. I have a depth of 150. Okay, so I'm going to need a depth module pretty early. What do I need for a depth module? Glass still ingot and enamel. Okay, well, I guess I'm, I'm going to need enamel glass uh, for this depth module. So at least I didn't totally waste my time. I'm going to need the diamonds at some point. I just didn't need them right now, you know? All right, I saw a bunch of stuff down in these uh, these crevices and stuff that I would, I, I'd like to just figure out what's down here. The sound just cut out for me. Why do I have no sound? It says that there's still sound recording, but I don't have any sound. Why'd that happen? Okay, so maybe there wasn't as much down here as I, as I thought there was. Did I not scan these? Oh, exterior grow beds. I feel like I saw these. I guess not. Okay. All right, cool. Well, so, you know, since we got the sea truck now, we might as well go back to um, the Delta Island and get our second diamond and um there was lithium over there as well and we're gonna need that for um the plastic ingots and uh, i think we're gonna need this depth module for it pretty quickly you know okay this looks like okay i think we we got to the island so let me i'm gonna go circle around it i know i saw lithium before but i was a little preoccupied and i had no inventory space looking for the diamonds like an idiot I, I hope the sound comes through. Oh, hello. You're weird looking. I hope the sound comes through in the video because I, I, I have completely lost all sound. Um, I, I don't know why. But uh, it says it's still going in the recording. So I, I'm just... I'm going to hope. And... Um, if there is no sound, then maybe I'll just find some uh, some Subnautica music I can put in the background to play for you guys, because I got nothing. Oh, ooh, hello, that's a Leviathan, right? Oh, God. Oh, get, get me out, get me out. Oh. Yeah, that's um that's a what you would call it. Oh, what is happening? Uh-oh. Oh, I'm spiraling. Spiraling. I am freaking out. Get me out of here. Get me out. Okay. Well, I really hope the audio um comes through in the video now because I I didn't hear that at all. I had no I had no idea that damn thing was so close to me. I'm gonna try to find that um that that underground mine thing that I saw before. I don't think I need to go close to the Leviathan to do that. I think I just I strayed a little too far. I just wanna make sure I got all the stuff there that I that I could now that I have a sea truck. I really wish I had audio. Oh my god. There's some lithium. Pick that up as I see it. Okay, I think this is where I need to be going, down here. Nice, okay, so, and I just went right into the door, but I can go down here now. So what is, what is up over here? What's that? Warning, passing 100 meters. Ooh, builder fragment. Oxygen efficiency decreased. Bioreactor. What? Habitat builder. New blueprint synthesized. Bioreactor. Do I? Oh, and the battery recharger. Ooh, fantastic. Oh. 
that yep there we go that is exactly what i was wanting to find thank you i'd love to find like a rebreather oh there's more lithium cool okay hold on and there's a little bit more to explore in here get back into the siege truck let me see if there's anything else in here and then this might be where i end it oh i can't even What the? <laughs> Can't even fit my fat ass in there. Okay, hold on. Hold on. There's some rubies. I should pick up these rubies. Oh, yeah. If there's rubies here, I definitely need to pick them up. Okay, let's get back to base. 100 meters. Ooh, what is this? What would got here? Rebreather. Oh, fantastic. That's great. Okay. Rebreather. Wiring kit, fiber mesh, silicone, rubber. 12 seconds later. Rebreather. Conserves oxygen when diving deeper, absorbs and recycles CO2 into breathable air. Carbon dioxide. The rebreather facilitates extensive free diving by recycling air more efficiently at significant depths. Nice. Breathe the freedom. Breathe the freedom. Cool. So it doesn't give us more air. It just has the air that we have last longer, right? I think that's what it does, basically. Let's build the Habitat Builder, and then we will um, finish the episode on that. Because that is something I would like to do um, next time. I think that would be very fun. And that's something that I personally enjoy quite a bit in this game. Cool. Okay, I need. I got that copper. High capacity O2 tank. Game knows what I'm looking for right now. New blueprint synthesized. Mm-hmm. Yep. I almost have those things, but I also need a uh, modification station, right? I think. All right, let's see if I can find some silver. There we go. All right, back to the sea truck, back to base, and get my habitat builder. And from there, we can really. I that that that's that's something I really wish I discovered and got into earlier in Subnautica. I I got it. I got the habitat builder and everything fairly quickly, but I was I didn't really like pick it up for a little bit. And I was like, eh, this doesn't really seem all that useful. And um, it ended up being my favorite part of the game, and uh, was incredibly useful. And it was a great use of time and energy, in my opinion. So it's something I would like to spend a lot of time doing in this game. Great. Okay. Cool. There we go. This is the best piece of equipment ever. Adding emergency awesome. shelter blueprints to your data bank with the builder tool, you can construct sea bases. I don't get a battery with it. Materials. Advising against exploring a frozen water continent without a base. No bed. No storage. Uh huh. No place to put a fabricator module. No fun. Hey, I mean. I got some good stuff. Got a fabricator, got all my, I got my lockers, my battery charger. Yeah, I mean, I, I am pretty good to go to uh, start building. So maybe depending on how, uh, how interested people are, that might be something I spend the whole next episode doing is just building a base, something not, not crazy. Um, just kind of to start with, get myself a room and a moon pool. If I can build that, I should be able to build that. I'm going to need a lot of titanium. I can find lead pretty easily. Sea truck dock. I wonder what that is. I'm curious about that as opposed to a moon pool. High power and structure requirements. Okay. Interesting. And we have the blueprint for a, a bioreactor. So that's really cool as well. And a solar panel if we want to do that. So yeah, I mean, we can really start 
getting into oh we have scanner room we have scanner room upgrades and stuff i mean we really we have a lot of a lot of options now so yeah thank you so much for watching i hope you enjoyed this episode and the first episode as well make sure to leave a like and subscribe if you haven't done so already i'm actually i'm actually really enjoying this so far playing subnautica first and then playing this kind of makes this experience a lot smoother for for me because i have a much better idea of what i'm supposed to be doing and how the game is works and is trying to progress the story and, and stuff like that so i'm enjoying it i'm getting i'm excited to get into the base building again yeah that, that's about it thank you for watching um hope you have a good day appreciate you all and uh yeah i'll see you in the next video bye bye